Hey, welcome to another adventure of Wisman Ranch. Today, we're going to be making some bat houses, some nursery bat houses, and it is exciting. Today, it is a balmy 23 degrees. It is December 30th, and the kids are outside playing. The dogs are outside playing. It's just a great day. So, why not get done some things that you need to get done? All right, stay tuned and we'll be getting ready to do it. Okay, what we have here is uh, four by eight pieces of plywood. One is three eighths inch, the other one is half inch. The half inch is going to be used as uh, the outside of the bat house and the three eighths will be used on the inside. We've already cut up a half inch piece. So we've got this one here and this one here and that one there. And I will include some plans within uh, this video or a link to them anyway. So anyway, stay tuned and we'll get kind of making it as we get it done. Oh, did you have a good Christmas? Oh, that's good because I had a good Christmas too. Look at my wife. She has her. All right. We put this wood burner in here too to keep it warm out here because it's a little chilly out. Anyway, all right. We'll chat with you in just a few minutes. We'll get this thing rocking. Mm, woo. Well, I've gotten all of my cuts done. I've got the bottom partition. This is the front lower, the roof, the walls, the back front, the sides. And uh, I've got everything done. As you can see on here, on the inside of the bat box, we've actually scored every single piece. So they have grip. They're able to grip on the bottom of the bat house. We use this little thing here. Just put some screws in there and started scraping it and uh, pretty much got it done. Now, the next thing we're gonna do is we are going to use um, wood stain, a dark wood stain to stain the whole entire inside. You wanna use stain, not paint, because if you use paint, the paint may uh, cover the holes on the all the stuff that we scored it would cover that up and the stain won't it just penetrates it and you want it to be dark because the darker the better it attracts it keeps the sun in uh keeps the heat in all that grooviness so um as soon as we get that part done and let it dry i'll give you a shout and show you all right stick around hey welcome back so what we're going to do is a step-by-step -step process of how to put this thing together as you can see we have all this going on. We have stained the inside boards to make it dark, except for these right here. Um, it doesn't matter. <clears throat> so we're gonna bang all these in right now. So what we've done is we've put in the roof support, the side boards, and these right here. Careful not to cover up the vents. Then we take this piece here, and we're gonna stick it in it's going to be a tight fit take it up and now that we got it bang those in place Shoot. so my wife just reminded me <laughs> That's why she's out here. Oh, I forgot to nail these in right here. These little five inch pieces. So no worries. I actually wood glue them first. And then um, once I wood glue them in, then I bang them. But what? You didn't nail the ones up here either. <laughs> See? Okay. <fine. laughs> You guys know, wives know everything. All right, so now <laughs> we got it. I'm gonna put this piece in here, drop it in. How far, how, is that supposed to go all the way up to the top here? Or not? I don't know, that's what I'm asking. Um, we'll just put it into right there, call it good. So just stick it in there. Okay. 
Okay. And then what we're going to do is we're going to continue climbing up the ladder with these right here. And once that's done, it's done. And I'll show you the finished product, or actually once we get to the very top, once we're almost done, I'll show you the rest and that's that. So stay tuned. All right, so we are at the final thing. This is pretty much it right here. All we gotta do is put the roof on and we are all set. So as I put the pieces on, I silicone them, <clears throat> I wood glue them, and I staple them just for waterproof purposes. And then I'll go ahead and silicone the outside. Once it's finished, I will stand it up and show you what it's supposed to look like. Bat house! It is complete! So, uh, it's only taken us about a day and a half to put this together, and the reason being it's been a little chilly out here in the garage. So, yesterday we did our thing, cut all the wood out, and then today we put it together. Um, but here it is. You can put steel on top, uh, galvanized metal roofing, or whatever you choose. You can roof it, whatever. Um, basically, you want to paint this a dark color. Latex outdoor exterior paint would be great. So we're going to paint it and hang it up. This is the first one we ever made. So I'm sure there are mistakes with it. You know what? Like with anything, you make mistakes, you learn from, you drive on. So um, other than that, that's it. Uh, we appreciate you watching. If you enjoyed it, thank you. If not, we don't give a crap. Go to another video because we don't care. We aren't, we're here as hobbyists. We're just having fun. We enjoy life. When you're retired, you can do that. Right, dear? That's right. Yeah, baby. All right. Woo. So until next time, next adventure, this is Wisman Ranch. I love ya. We out.